Alrighty guys, hello and welcome back to the show. I hadn't planned on recording this game, but um, this is initially going to be a 1v1 between me and uh, another dude uh, that I've actually done a co-cast with and not sure if I'm going to upload this video or that other video first. Probably need to figure that one out. Um, but either way, uh, the other guy is Conorak. He is uh, the dark blue player in the northern to the north of me. He's playing UEF. Um, but he and I did a co-cast. So uh, I've, I'm probably going to upload and publish that one first. But if you guys haven't seen that, go check it out. I'll try and remember to link it down in the description below. I'm terrible at linking things in, in the description. But this is a 5v5. It's a map gen. It's pretty standard. I'm playing Cybran. Oh, I thought there was another player to the south of me. There isn't. All right. Well, it's time to go. Grab some mexes, grab some stuff. Play, uh, and yeah, play as well as I can. So, um, in this game, I hosted this game, so that's the only reason I know this, but Rowan is, I think, either playing this slot or this slot, if I'm remembering correctly. So, um, yeah, if you check the scoreboard, <laughs> he's, he's in the game. Which is not going to be too much fun. Um, but in this game, I need to expand forward. So in the vein of trying to keep this educational, I need to expand forward as much as I can. Actually, I sh probably shouldn't take um, these three mexes in the hydro either. That should be for uh, Dante, who's another good buddy of mine. To the north of me. We'll go ahead and grab that. Uh, I'm going to save that reclaim for somebody else. Uh, grab this rock and then expand out. Commander's idle, which is always good. <laughs> it's not good. Um, I think I'm going to use my comm for its build power a little bit more. Uh, at least early on in this game. <laughs> so yeah, I'm I'm dropping like a lot of T1 radar in the middle to uh, uh, try and get as much radar as I can. Dante's going for that. Um, I'll let him know that these are for him. Some nice guy like that. I leave Mexus for my teammates. I don't leave any power for my teammates. So Jesus Christ, I'm stalling really bad. The hell is going on here oh it's because i'm building like multiple radars at the same time and expanding and yeah it's okay uh, this will it'll ride it'll ride out we're okay maybe Gonna go for a lot of T1 spam though. Uh, in this slot, I need to I need to shut down and secure as much of this bottom half as I can. It's kind of the point of all of these engineers and radars and things like that that I'm doing to set up right now. Okay, Jesus, this energy stall is actually not going away. I've done a supremely good job at neutering my economy before I even have gotten started. Wow, I didn't even grab my... What the hell am I doing? I thought I had that queued up. I didn't. So I completely thought I queued up that mech, or that uh, hydro. I hadn't. 
I'm just going to try and throw. I'm just going to try and brute force my way to victory here. So Rowan is... Okay, Rowan's in the back slot. There is no full share on this game. Um, I don't know. It's personal preference as far as like whether you like full share or not. I don't think there's any way to play this game that's better or worse. I think the most important thing is that you're playing. Oh, that was what I had my... Okay. This factory actually needs to get done. This one does not. Oh yeah, because I need, I need to get some units out into the field. And I'm not getting anything out right now because of the way that I set up my queue. I don't want to change it. Not yet, at least. Okay, thank God this is about to come up. This is about to solve all my problems whenever that thing comes online. I have no air factory either. That's another big problem. Yeah, so some people were asking my most recent videos if uh, what, what I'm doing whenever I'm right-clicking assist on another factory. The reason I'm doing that is because this is going to allow me these factories to inherit this build queue. So I set up one build queue out of a factory and then I'm good to go um, as far as just clicking other factories to assist it. It's a really, really handy way to uh, duplicate build queues across multiple factories instead of manually going and setting them up every time. I don't know how that works, but these guys have a mix up there and uh, no other maxes queued up. Uh, and try and go for some T2 max. T2 maxes. What I got here? Okay, so I've got a couple of engineers that are sitting here. This guy wants you to stop. We're going to start going T2. Put some assistance on that. Put some assistance on that. Uh, I think we're good on power. All right. Uh, Calm needs to start moving to the front. I I need to start pressuring this. I need to start pressuring this pink guy like three minutes ago. I'm I'm really late here. As far as like actually pressuring my lane and doing something productive, I've been giving him way too much space. Because I'm in semi of a power slot because of the number of mexes that I have. So what Rowan is going to do this game, Rowan likes to build walls. I discovered that earlier tonight. So yeah, we're going to get in here. We're going to take out as many mexes as we can without losing too many units. Disrupt the uh, overall strategy there. Send this guy to tech two. Um, probably dump my body some mass. I can start upgrading. I can upgrade. Jesus, I can upgrade a lot. I have a lot of mass right now. Uh, what's going to be really painful though is whenever I go for T2 power, which is going to happen here pretty soon. It's going to be really rough. Oh, that's a power stall again. And that one is going to have to be a power saw that I just kind of ride out. It's not really going to be anything I can do about it. Uh, we're going to fight this. Looks like we can win. Who's the light pink guy? Hurt much. Okay. 1,000 rated player, so obviously not an idiot, but not like a god. Oh no. Alright, well, Wombat is dead. I used to start thinking about what I'm going to do. I think I'm going to go T2 on the commander go for stealth. It's okay, that'll do wonderful things for my power grid. So we get a lag here as some player is leaving. Oh, we did not get either plateau. That's a bummer. I didn't even register that as something we needed to be doing. I guess Conorak should have been doing that, but 
He's been busy helping me on the bottom. He's going for his own comm upgrade up there. He's also got, uh, yeah, some of these mexes. So we do have a pretty good hold on the bottom side of the map. I think at this point it'd be good for me to stop making T1 potentially. Trying to get these uh, power generators up. That's a commander down there. We don't want to deal with that. So we're bringing these troops back because I'm running into his commander. I'm sorry I'm zooming in and out so much. Uh, that's kind of the way that I play the game is I zoom in really close and then zoom out really far. Uh, okay, we're gonna send some of these to Tech 2. I'm gonna do that instead of building new Tech 2 factories. I think that's gonna be a little bit better use of my time. I'm actually going to fire this guy back up with another Tech 1 Q. Because Soup is pushing on this side with a good number of Tech 1 units. I'm going to need something to be able to stop that. So we're going to fire these bad boys back up. Alright. Uh, tech 1 power generators are done. Always be ecoing. As much as you can. I should have these ringed actually as well. This guy should also be tech two. Go ahead and slam that guy to tech two. Real quick. Uh, these these mass swords are gonna give me like a good cushion as well as far as um, flash mass expenditures like upgrading to tech three or uh, what I'm doing with my commander right now, things like that. Um so in the middle, I'm gonna go for something a little weird. Or not not necessarily weird, but something I don't usually do, uh, which is a TML. Put a TMD here as well as a flak. Can I afford that? Probably not. Although it's mostly because I've got a ton of mass going into this Tech 2 Max right now, which is fine. Uh, soup is fighting me there. I pull these guys up north to deal with hurt much. Deal with soup's units here. Not sure what Stasm is doing. Stasm seems to be going for Tech 2 Air and Stingers. Another good friend of mine. Stasm's. Oh my god, I went for another. Uh, mm. It's painful. I misclicked and went for a second HQ. That is uh, ultra omega bad. <laughs> Going for a second HQ. Oh, that's that's probably the dumbest thing I've ever done. Nah, it's not the dumbest thing I've ever done. It's definitely one of the dumbest things I've ever done, though. So we'll be able to deal with this without it causing too many issues. Just need to deal with this Tham. Done and dusted. Now we can start pushing back against Hurt Much. Sasm's trying to deal with that stuff up north. I have way too many Tech 2 engineers. Uh, Tech 3 land? Question mark? Sure, let's go for it. Let's get some more eco. Let's get you two to start ringing these bad boys down here. Uh, yeah. All right, let's bag us uh, a couple of T2 Mexes. These have got to be Tech 2. There's no way, right? Just gonna drop a point of defense there. I'm gonna lose my commander if I don't do if I'm not careful. While I'm trying to fight elsewhere, my commander is in a very dangerous location. Truth be told, did I go for a T2? Jesus Christ! 
three T2. Oh my god. That. Uh, that is beyond stupid. I can't. That might be. Well, now this video has to go to YouTube. Because there's no way I'm not going to upload me misclicking for three Tech 2 HQs. How am I, how am I not going to do that? Okay, which one? Okay, so that is... This is the button you need, you need to click. This guy, right here. The second one, not the first one. Do not click this button. Click that button. Jesus. Just to be clear, that one is upgrading to a Tech 2 Land Factory, not a Tech 2 HQ. Thank God. Alright. We got broadswords on Dante as well. Not really sure what Dante's been doing. Soup is up here just doing whatever the hell he pleases. Should have tightened up those. Uh, oh shit, Rowan's gonna. Rowan's gonna be able to take those out. Alright. We need to take three up. Well, Dante's down. Yep, we're losing this game. And you know the reason why we lost this game? It's because of these fucking three HQs that I accidentally built. I can't believe I was that stupid. I literally I literally cannot believe that I that I didn't see that. I mean it definitely hasn't helped that definitely has not helped that uh, Rowan has been able to do kind of whatever he wants as far as as far as air goes but you know it is what it is uh, three HQs three count them count them one two three God, I can't believe I was that stupid. It's okay. I'll save you the trouble, Rowan. Under well, now this video has definitely got to go to YouTube. Thank you all so much for watching. <laughs> watching some of the dumbest things I've ever done in this game. I can't believe I did it not only once, but twice. I did it twice. God. Uh. All right. Well, thank you all so much for watching, and I will see, see y'all in the next game. Peace.